My name is Koen Peters. I manage supply chain planning and optimization projects for the World Food Programme, you know, the world's largest humanitarian agency uh, saving and changing lives worldwide. About a decade ago, um, I went to a conference where I learned that we were already growing enough food in the world to feed the entire global population. But there were still 800 million people that were going to bed hungry. So I, I was shocked. Um, I had spent the last three years studying how to efficiently get products from, from A to B uh, through optimization. So something really kind of clicked for me and I decided that I would try to use my optimization expertise to contribute to this global hunger problem. Together with the Zero Hunger Lab, I'm researching what it takes to put optimization tools in action. How can they actually be used by humanitarians to improve operations? Humanitarian emergencies are very complex and therefore difficult to manage. Uh, this year alone, uh, the World Food Programme needs to reach more than 170 million people uh, worldwide. Um, and because these operations are so complex to manage, we need to find a very kind of cheap way to provide that assistance. But at the same time, we want the food to be locally purchased. We want it to be safe, nutritious, healthy. We want to make sure that it also matches the dietary preference of the population. And of course, we want this to be as environmentally sustainable as, as possible. As a mathematician, I've learned to somehow model these different preferences and restrictions and options into you know, a mathematical puzzle. And the nice thing about a mathematical puzzle is that it has a solution. So my favorite example of this is Optimus. Uh, Optimus is a tool that we developed together with partners like the Zero Hunger Lab to help us really design our operations. So at the heart of this optimization model uh, is really a complex mathematical formula essentially that considers the entirety of an operation uh, for the World Food Programme all the way from the design of the food basket uh, all the way to its final delivery. What this allows us to, to do is to really explore different what-if scenarios. Uh, what if we change from beans to peas? Uh, what if we want to buy more locally? Uh, what if we want to distribute cash instead of food? Optimist then quickly evaluates what it would take to actually implement this kind of new design and what it would cost to the, uh, to the organization, uh, resulting in very quick uh, response to, to, new, uh, to new emergencies. It's been amazing to see what we've been able to do with Optimus and also other optimization tools in the World Food Programme. It has allowed us really to be much more efficient with our resources and we were able to reach millions more than we otherwise would have without using optimization. The challenges ahead are still very complex, but everywhere that I look, I see people trying to help, trying to improve food security for people all over the world. Together, I'm confident that we'll be able to do this and achieve a world with zero hunger.